What is going on, guys? Retex Mojo here. Hope I won't today. I a brand new video for you guys. And yes, we do have a brand new hero coming to Marvel Super War. I actually do know who it is, and you guys will be finding out very shortly. So, let's get into the overall heroes right now first. So, we currently have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 42 heroes okay now we're gonna go into every category and see how many we have of each so if we go into fighter all right we have 11 here okay 11 from 42 huge number 25 percent power we have nine close to 11 of course uh, that leaves us with 22 heroes left for four more categories marksman we have six. Assassin, we have eight. Tank, we have seven. And support, we have five. So not a whole lot of support or even tank. Now, this person here, <coughs> we were given some clues about this new hero, saying that they're the protector of Atlantis. And kind of gave us like a silhouette and like a staff or a trident if you will so i'm gonna bring that up right now guys and we're gonna go talk about it all right guys so right now we do have the picture brought up here for this brand new hero now looking at this person here you see the staff and the trident clear as day basically and you got the swiggle of in the hair up front and overall, doesn't look like anything too crazy. Now, there was speculation before I heard that uh, they were the protector of Atlantis on who I thought this was. I thought this was going to be Aquaman, right? Because everybody knows Aquaman has the trident. Um, that's basically like his main thing that everybody knows about him. However, given the circumstances on the information that we have about this hero, it's actually Namor, N-A-M-O-R, if you haven't heard of him. I actually have not heard of him myself. So I was actually kind of surprised that it wasn't Aquaman because I was reading uh, some replies to his post and people were saying that it was Namor. And I had to look it up to see if that was true. And apparently this is Namor, guys. So... I looked up some more information about him because, like I said, I never heard of him. And I looked up his powers and abilities. He has superhuman strength, speed, agility, that type of stuff. Not like a crazy, you know, hero that has crazy superpowers, but he does have all those I did mention. So let's head back into Marvel Super War, and I'll give you some thoughts really quickly. So guys, now we know that the new hero is Namor, I'm thinking what class he could be in. Alright, what category? Fighter, power, marksman, etc. So, going back into fighters, we have plenty of fighters. But, he has superhuman strength, speed, agility, that type of stuff in the comics. Okay, I don't know what's going to translate into here. If they're going to do something similar, I don't know. Power... I don't know if he can technically fit into the power category. Maybe fighter, but like I said, we do have a lot of heroes in this class already. So it's a toss up. I was thinking more of Marksman. Alright. With his trident, his staff, whatever you want to call it. He could use that to kind of shoot out energy. I'm going to say energy attack, probably. Uh, from the staff. Or like I was saying with, uh, or it's possible he could be a fighter with Superman straight. He could hit people with his trident and his staff. I don't know what to call it. I'm just going to call it a staff because I don't want to keep confusing everybody. So he kind of do like close range attacks or further range attacks with it. So that's why I was also kind of leaning towards Marksman. For Assassin, I'm going to say no, not at all. He's probably not that you know type of hero could be fast that's the thing so 
could potentially be in here uh, with like a weaker attack type of thing. Defense probably a little bit better. Tank, I'm gonna say not at all. Uh, I'm not even gonna entertain that whatsoever. Support is also possible, and I'll tell you why. Because he has like a whole bunch of abilities that he could do with like the water. I think he has like tel telepathy or something. Uh, he has other water abilities that maybe, you know, he can surround somebody in a certain area with water and it'll heal them or give them a buff of defense, that type of thing. There's many different avenues that they could go with in the more here that honestly, I'm not 100% on one specific class that he could be in. Let me know what you guys think down below, which class you think he'd be in. And of course, give me the reason why, because I would love to know. I kind of give you my reasons why he could be for each, not amazing reasons. But of course, it's just speculation at this point until he actually does get released. So that'll be the end of this video. If you guys did enjoy, drop a like, subscribe if you're new. And yeah, guys, I'm out. Have a wonderful day. Peace.